Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jade. If you're returning, welcome back, girl. How are you? How are you doing? Um, so in some of my older videos, um, especially my bartender vlogs, y'all wanted me to keep doing the bartender vlogs, but um, if y'all personally know me, y'all know that I kind of exited out the club game. Um, so the bartender vlogs have kind of slowed down a bit, but we're not back in the game. Let me, let me, don't, I don't want y'all to get excited. We're not back in the game, but we have been picking up a lot more jobs. So y'all wanted the bartending vlogs. So guess what you're getting this weekend? A bartending vlog. Um, I'm, I'm excited. I'm not excited to go back to the club scene. Um, and to be completely honest with you, it's really just because I don't got lazy. Like, I don't want to, I'm tired. I don't want to do it no more. Um, but it's a job and it's money, so we're going. Um, we got hired, my bartending company got hired to bartend um, two homecoming events this weekend. So we will be in Orangeburg. We'll be bartending for South Carolina State's homecoming. Um, it's going to be a time. It should be a time. It should be an experience, but it should also be some money made. So I will be bringing y'all along with me to Barton Homecoming. Um, and then Sunday, I got picked up to do um, a tasting for, let me say the, hold on. Heaven Hill Brands Liquor. So for the specific liquor that we're doing on Sunday is Larceny. Um, it's a very, 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 very <laughs> strong whiskey um i don't have the bottle in here with me but i y'all saw me taste it on my halloween vlog um very strong it's 92 percent proof not percent 92 proof um a really sweet whiskey though like i'm not gonna lie like the flavor profile is really good and um i hacked a recipe for it which i'm very excited to film that and post that as well um because what i chose to pair with it really brings out that flavor and complements it very well so um yeah on sunday i'm doing a tasting at a lounge restaurant um in columbia but very excited for that because it is an infinite number of possibilities that can come out of that partnership, um, especially because they're trying to push that whiskey um, very hard. So I'm just very thankful, very blessed for that partnership to come along um, because like I said, lots of opportunities can come out of that if I play my cards right. So we literally have back to back to back days of bartending so y'all get a full bartending vlog i know y'all are excited i know y'all missed it y'all wanted that so we're back um before we even head into that so it's 10 o'clock now like i said i've been to work um already i do have to go back but um the difference between working in the club and then doing freelance work is you get a little bit more freedom. Um, you get a little bit more say in what goes on. And um, I will say this, this bartending and this homecoming is gonna be a little different also because I just, I didn't get hired just to bartend. Um, I got hired to bring on a team. So I'll be taking some girls with me. I also need to, and this is so slack on my part, please do not be like me. Don't be like me because it don't work for everybody. Um, but I had a busy week at work, so I didn't get to come around to doing this the way that I wanted to, but I need to create menus for these events. Um, so I will be doing that really quickly. I need to go get them printed, laminated, and then um, I was thinking about doing personalized tip jars. I don't know if I wanna do all that uh, because I also might go to the store and pick out something for this weekend. Even though I really, really, really don't feel like spending money. Y'all know me, I don't really like spending a lot of money on bartending uniforms because when I get down and dirty, like I don't really care about being cute and I don't like my cute clothes getting messed up because it might be some spillages or something. So I might go pick out something just because I'm not gonna be as sexy as everybody else. Like I don't have the lace or whatever. Um, 
and I really I <laughs> don't really care for it to be honest with you it's cold outside I don't like being uncomfortable when I'm bartending um but we'll see I have some clothes but like I said they're like regular just when you're in the club uniforms or whatever um but they're cute they're just not sexy and you know lacy and all that stuff um so depending on how my time's looking because I also need to clean my house I don't want to go the Orangeburg is an hour away from where I am um and I don't want to come back to no dirty house because we're not getting off until two o'clock and I gotta travel back um and like I said it's gonna be a busy weekend so I would like for my house to be in order before we go so we got a lot to do before I need to be on the road by six um so I would like to start getting ready around like I know four gonna sound wild y'all but I gotta mentally like make sure that I, we're not packing anything this time but just make sure you know I got everything just in case um I need to text him and see if he got cash boxes yeah that's that and i'm not, like i said i know you're excited i know y'all wanted these bartender vlogs so it's back we're in it so i'm gonna catch up with y'all later but yeah it's gonna be a good week good weekend good weekend it's gonna be a great weekend um but i'll catch y'all later Trying to figure out the whole thing I saw people doing things Almost gave up on the music thing But we all so spoiled now More life, more everything Must have never had your phone tap All that yapping on the phone shit You must really love the road life All that never coming home shit Free smoke, free smoke, ayy Free smoke, free smoke, ayy Free smoke, free smoke, ayy John Rose, they toes Hit the hills where I post I start my day slow Silver pajamas when I wake though Mirror bow to the face though Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday. I am getting ready to go to my last bartending job of the weekend. Um, this is the tasting for the Larceny Whiskey. I'm very excited about this because, like I said, this is going to be a new partnership with Heaven Hills Liquor or company, brewing company, whatever. Um, but yeah, y'all, this weekend had went so well. I am just so, 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 so super proud of all of the bartenders who came out with us. Just super proud of me and Nita um, for just doing it. Like, we literally have kind of built this company off of, like, nothing, like, no type of help. We were very new to the club game, to the bartending business. Um, so for us just to have like these successful events mean so much to me and they just make me so happy. Like I'm so proud of what we are able to accomplish on our own. Like no friends in the game, no nothing. Like literally just coming in, being good people and building something off of that. <laughs> um, so just very, very, very happy about how this weekend came or turned out. Um, where is Murphy? But I'm about to film um, some short form content, so we're gonna have to speed this part up.
Good morning, y'all. I had such a long weekend. I had such a long weekend, but a very successful weekend nonetheless. And y'all, when I tell y'all, I'm just so happy. Like all last night, we definitely went out and celebrated. Um, but all I kept saying was, I'm just so happy and proud of where me and my best friend have taken this business all on our own. Like nobody gave us no sauce, no nothing. And for us to be able to have something that actually works and for it to be as successful as it is. And I'm not even talking about success in like, we're, we're this huge big company, but like when we come out and we do jobs, like we do a really good job of just getting a job done. Um, and I'm just so thankful. I'm so thankful. I'm so proud of us. Like we we had a really, really, really successful weekend this weekend. I don't know y'all, this is, this is the end of this vlog. Um, I'm very sorry. I tried to get as much footage as I could for y'all. Um, but like I said, once you get to working, sometimes it do get hard um, to actually like stop what you're doing and film and try to get what I need. But like I said, it was a good weekend nonetheless. I'm very, very, very thankful. And um, we will have more. We will have more because this weekend really opened up other opportunities for us. So definitely more bartending jobs coming, more opportunities coming. But um, to anyone who has ever supported my business in any type of way, even if it was just sharing our promotional content or just secretly supporting us, like I'm beyond thankful for literally everything, like everything. And yes, I look. I look a hot ass mess. We got in very late um, and I had to wake up to go get my son. But yeah, that's it, that's all. Like I said, just very thankful for literally everything. Like, very thankful for everything. But I will see y'all, I gotta sit down and really try and finish editing all this stuff. I literally got three vlogs lined up back to back to back. Um, and this week I would like to sit down and film some content, so. Oh, dang, I got a conference on Thursday. Dang. Dang. All right, man. I'll see y'all. I'll see y'all. When I see y'all. <laughs>